welcome to another video today we'll be preparing them um, cassava they call it the uh, tapioca some people call it umpataka some people call it um, you can call it ataka or you can call it ibaru southeast region of Nigeria and uh, some part in south south although the slicing of this um, cassava but now this food is derived from cassava from cassava to pass that's where we collected the food from so uh, different places in south south and uh, southeast have different way of slice have different shapes different ways of slicing it the one i'm doing here in the video is uh, peculiar to the southeast the southeast people if you are from that place i believe you'll be familiar with this type of food you know that this other one they call um uh, um apacha apacha yeah they, they call it uh, we can call it african salad or so but that's not what we are preparing this one is cassava and uh, just watch make sure you watch the end if you know this food or you have eaten it before let us know at the comment section we want to know the people who are familiar with this food so if you are watching us from any part of the world it's your first time also let us know that this is my first time of seeing this and this kind of food you, you will like it if you taste it you watch it maybe you can prepare it by yourself or something let's keep watching it uh, the young man who is preparing this food is taking his time at the time in the world you know he's doing it it's not actually easy the way you are seeing it you know sometimes he's gone he's, uh, somehow but you know keep cutting it but if you are familiar or you know how to do this it will not be that hard for you so keep watching keep watching this guy this guy is tired it's not easy to slice this amount of cassava it's not easy look at him no way to smile again he's tired but what do we do keep on thank you very much for watching keep watching our videos more video more videos are coming in the comments we are done guy is done slicing the next thing is to soak it inside water and allow it to ferment uh, but this particular one will soak it till the next day till the next day then the next day if you have not watched that uh, other video you can go and watch it this is me soaking it with water and after this will allow it to stay till the next day the next day so thank you very much for watching see you in our next video please you can try this at home and i promise you you're gonna love it you're gonna love it thank you very much share drop your comment and 
follow subscribe to our youtube channel at smart kitchen and food and share our video we love you see you at the top see you our next video keep watching share it to your friends and loved ones and your groups various groups you see you can see where it is looking now see you in our next video thank you